All right, listen up. This is the bisexual manifesto. Boys, it's still relevant. We are tired of being analyzed, defined, and represented by people other than ourselves, or worse yet, not considered at all. We are frustrated by the imposed isolation and invisibility that comes from being told or expected to choose either a homosexual or heterosexual identity. Monosexuality is a heterosexist dictate used to oppress homosexuals and to negate the validity of bisexuality. Bisexuality is a whole fluid identity. Do not assume bisexuality is binary or duogamous in nature, that we have two sides or must be involved simultaneously with both genders to be fulfilled human beings. In fact, don't assume there are only two genders. Do not mistake our fluidity for confusion, irresponsibility, or an inability to commit. Do not equate promiscuity, infidelity, or unsafe sexual behavior with bisexuality. Those are human traits that cross all sexual orientations. Nothing should be assumed about anyone's sexuality, including your own. We are angered by those who refuse to accept our existence, issues, contributions, alliance, and voice. It is time for the bisexual voice to be heard. 1990, that's 31 years old, and boy, is it still relevant. Let's unpack this. We are tired of being represented by people other than ourselves or being not being considered at all. Boy, is that still true. A lot of people who are not bisexual have a ton of opinions about bisexuality. They say, because you're dating a woman and you're a man, doesn't that make you straight now? No. Because you're bisexual, but you're dating somebody trans, shouldn't you just say you're pansexual? No. Bisexuality has always, always been inclusive and aware of trans people. And it says it right here. Don't assume there are only two genders. It's highlighted in this picture. Don't mistake our fluidity for confusion. I still get people asking me if I'm just confused or that I'll pick a side. You don't. That's not how it works. This is 31 years old. People who wrote this still haven't picked a side. Bisexuality has been around for longer than I have been alive. This is just one of the most milestone writings on it. It predates this. The Greeks had this. The Greeks were aware of this. It is very well known. People still tell me that I should just say I'm pan because I'm bisexual and aware of trans people. No. It's just as bad as people who say you're dating a woman. You should just say you're straight. Also, no. It's not a personal preference or anything related to choice. It is a part of an identity. People still sometimes wonder if I will have commitment issues. That has nothing to do with being bisexual. I might, but it wouldn't have to do with me being bisexual. People assume that I'm a slut because I'm bisexual. I am, but not because I'm bisexual. Just a slut. Those are two separate parts of me that exist at the same time, but don't interact with each other. They are not dependent on one another. They could both exist in a vacuum without one another. Most things could. Bisexuality is always, always been aware of trans people. And you don't need to say you're pansexual because you respect trans people you can still say you're bisexual the difference between bisexuality and pansexuality are not really well understood by way too many people on the internet but the distinction is there and it matters to people so you should respect it and boy is it still time for the bisexual voice to be heard this is 31 years old and boy is it still relevant september is bisexuality awareness month Gay Pride Month, LGBTQA plus Pride Month, is in June. September is Bisexual, Bisexuality Awareness Month and Pride Month, but we've already had Pride. It's Bisexual Wrath Time, you know? Let's get another sin in there. Shout this shit from the rooftops. Always been aware of trans people, not promiscuous or unfaithful because of bisexuality those are things that people do not things that bisexuals do gay wrath month y'all and hey just so we're all clear here don't assume anything about anyone's sexuality including your own but if someone tells you that they are bisexual listen to them that is not an assumption they say i am bisexual don't assume that they're straight or pan that's called bi erasure and it is an epidemic. We are tired of not being represented by ourselves. We are tired of being analyzed, defined, and represented by people other than ourselves. It says it right there. And it is still a problem. Don't 
say shit about bisexuality not being a valid sexuality. The name, at the very least, has existed for 31 years. And it goes back way further than this. It's real. We're here. We've been here. We're queer. We've been queer. Bisexuality Wrath Month. It's starting. 